let's check out this foldable boom arm for your desk mount, right? Mounting on your table for just about any microphone you have out there, whether it's a dynamic microphone like this, a condenser, this is meant to accommodate just about any microphone for gaming, for podcasting. Huh, and this is the device we are going to review today, Techies and Gamers, the fold mount for microphone. Okay, cool. Nothing too special and flashy about this box, right? But is the device good? Let's take a look. Unboxing the device right here in all of our faces. My hopes are kind of high for this. So styrofoam, we don't need that. In the box, you're gonna get your awesome instructions here. Very simplistic looking set of instructions here for setting up pretty cool. Um, I'm probably not gonna use these instructions because we're taking the gamers and we're gonna freestyle everything in life, everything. What? In the box is your your arm and components falling out and little Velcro straps that come in the box in a little drug bag. What? Oh, wow. Just feeling the arm off the rip, throw the box out. Tiny arm for starters, right? Look at that compact profile here. And we have the bottom piece, which you use to screw and fasten onto your desk. And I see that this thing maybe like a rubber piece we're gonna find out and of course your voice cracks what and you have the mic mount there of course it's going to accommodate three eighths as well as five eighths tread microphones right so versatility there but the thing i am feeling when pulling this out of the box is it's heavy yes this little thing is heavy because it is aluminum alloy, nice metal. Now, how tight is this thing here? Ah, uh, very nice and smooth to unscrew. Unscrewing this, I see that in here, there is in fact foam. Yes, you will get some soft cushion there so it doesn't damage the bottom of your table. And on the top as well, this component here is also a soft rubbery foam so good keep my nice wooden table here in good condition now how do we unlock this arm because this seems to be pretty tight here wow wow this thing is super tight to take out look at that look at the uh, oof, this thing once you position this arm on your table don't ever move it because the tightness is for real. I will say off the rip, maybe a little too tight for my taste. And if you notice, there are two joints side by side here. It can actually fold on one and on the other here. So you have two locations, as you can see, one is facing up and one is straight down, but you can bend it. So I presume that this arm can hold about 99 pounds based off the joint strength we have going on here. So, wow, let's get this mounted and see how this looks in comparison to something like this, which is a little bit more flashy. This is just a metal arm. I also noticed that there is no way for you to kind of hide or route your cabling. So you would be essentially tying your USB cable coming from your microphone or your XLR via these velcro straps unlike this arm right here which has a channel to route your cabling through but it's also not as low profile and small and condensable like this one here so uh yeah let's get this mounted i'm gonna mount it right here on the side all right so just to get a feel for the scale and scope of this little tiny arm here which every pivot on this thing is super tight so wherever you place it and if you bump into it this thing is not going to move unlike how loose and malleable this is although you can actually tighten this up on the actual base here with a little allen key there's something to make this 360 pivot a little bit tighter this one here very tight look at the strength you have to use to move this thing around i'm arm wrestling right now so looking at the flexibility of this device, there's a lot of different ways you can orient this. If you don't want to use the entire 
I guess, length of your arm. You can kind of fold it back, right? Like that and fight. Hopefully my table doesn't snap in half. And you have something as condensed and tiny as that. This is just to give you an idea of the scope and size of this little arm compared to something like a full sized arm on your table. So just looking at one of the orientations, I can actually have a microphone set on this is like so, and it is super low to the table and just kind of brings the mic right beneath me so I can probably get some really good audio with the mic like this. The only thing I don't like about this kind of setup is that I like moving my arms a lot, if you haven't noticed by now, and the mic essentially would get in my way. But if I wasn't that kind of a speaker, then this would be the ideal position. So as you see here, there is quite some flexibility going on with this particular boom arm and just about any microphone that you use, whether it's this mic here, dynamic condenser microphones, and just like that, I can switch out my microphone and use just about any microphone such as this PD200X, which was mounted on this arm right here. And you get a fantastic visual appearance on screen. So whether it's a dynamic or condenser, non-dynamic microphone, such as this cardioid mic right here, skies are the limit. Now on the site, it states that this boom arm supports 3.3 pounds i would even venture to say that it supports even more so yeah 3.3 is probably the minimum i would even go up to like four or five pounds so yeah this is a pretty sturdy strong low profile metal arm for your microphones so techies and gamers what do i think of this device overall i'm just gonna end it with this microphone right here because this is a very nice mic and i did do a review of this joby microphone check the link in the description any hardware you see on this video all the links are in the description so pros one the metallic build this thing is super hardcore and strong and metal and sturdy you are not going to break it throw it out the window from the fifth floor this will survive may get scrapes and dents but it will still work after that drop so kudos to that of course i do like as another pro all of the joints you have here there are so many different i guess pivots along this arm that you can bend it and twist it another pro is that it has it mounts just about any mic 3 8 or 5 8 inch tread you have all of those options built into this arm for improvements i would say that if there were a, another version of this they were going to build out i would say to have it uh detachable from the desk mount so that you can simply just pull off the top piece and not have to worry about removing the mount if you just wanted to take the actual arm off and keep the mount on your table if you're kind of like me you move your table around a little bit two i think that the arm are maybe just a little too tight a little bit of loosening would have been okay, but then you kind of lose the uh, the amount of weight that it can support, but otherwise very, very tight arm. Three, maybe if they figured out a way to figure out some kind of cable routing for the cabling, as opposed to using the straps to tie it down, that would be an improvement. Includes a total of five straps, so not too bad, so that you can kind of route your cable and keep it low profile. Right now I have the cable zigzagging right along the arm so that you can't really see it other than just this piece, which has to get plugged into the microphone. There is a 40% discount right now on Amazon. I am also including an additional 20% code down in the description courtesy of blue line providing all of these discounts i really appreciate it otherwise without the discounts it's over a hundred dollars so take advantage now you can get it close to probably 50 bucks right now to get yourself a pretty decent quality arm here that will last you for ages all right take easy gamers and with that i'll see you in my next video later